Hi guys, I am Viva. Today I'm going to show you how to make homemade mayonnaise. It's very easy, fast, and it's delicious and healthy without preservatives and all that junk that's put in the mayonnaise in the store. You need two eggs, oil, a little Dijon mustard, pinch of salt, a little lemon, and that's it. So it's a beautiful day. Let's have some fun. I'll just squeeze a little lemon juice in a bowl because I'm going to need some. You can substitute the fresh lemon juice with white vinegar or clear vinegar or you can use uh, the lemon juice from the bottles as you wish. And now what we have to do is separate the egg whites from the egg yolks because we are going to need only the egg yolks try to find absolutely fresh eggs organic possibly if you have uh, someone with a farm close to you try to get good eggs because in mayonnaise the eggs won't be cooked i'll start by separating my egg whites from the egg yolks it's very easily done what you have to do is just run it back and forth between the shells and there it is or you can use your hands and just hold the yolk and let the egg white just drip between your fingers either way whatever works for you and don't throw the egg whites away you can uh, cover them with uh, foil and use them for something else now to this I am going to add just a teaspoon of fresh lemon Dijon mustard it's a good one about this much that's perfect and nice pinch of salt to mix all that you can use your food processor or blender I'm gonna use my hand mixer and I'll start mixing the eggs with the mustard and that's good okay going to the oil I am using one cup of canola oil because it doesn't have any flavor feel free to use olive oil and if you use olive oil I would suggest light olive oil because it doesn't have that strong taste but if you like it go ahead use the extra virgin olive oil and of course you can substitute the eggs if you are worried that they're not cooked you can use a uh, egg substitute I'm gonna start pouring very slowly to incorporate the oil but that has to go very slow let's do it and when you have poured about half of the oil you don't have to be that precise and pour it very tiny so go ahead pour it and keep mixing you see that guys it's simple as that and there is your mayonnaise guys look at this perfect in only a few minutes let me show you look at that creamy perfect consistency why buy the stuff from the grocery store when you know what's in this you're gonna eat that so you know what you put in that this you can just 
pour in a container or a jar and refrigerate and use whenever you wish and make whenever you want one thing let me mention some people like to add to their uh, homemade mayonnaise white or black pepper by taste choose again it's your choice and let me give it a taste it's delicious and it has this salty flavor because I added a little salt it's perfect go make that at home if you like it give me the thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time bye